We are told that Jamil makes a drink by mixing one part of orange squash with nine parts of water. He uses 750 milliliters of orange squash. Jamil is going to put the drink he has mixed into one liter bottles. Work out the greatest number of one liter bottles that Jamil can completely fill, and this question is worth three marks. Okay? So, the first thing is we're going to uh, find how much water is used. So, one, uh, how much water is used. So, okay. we know that the ratio of orange squash to water is one to nine. Okay, so if he uses 750 milliliters of orange squash, we need to work out how much uh, water he uses. Okay, so uh, how many milliliters of water, sorry, he uses. So to get from one part to 750, you multiply by 750 like this, which means we need to multiply nine parts by 750 to find how many milliliters of water he uses. Okay, so what we will say is that this uh, question mark equals nine times 750 milliliters. Okay, I'm just going to do the uh, column multiplication here, so times like this, and we have our carry value. So nine times zero is zero. 9 times 5 is 45, so we write the 5 down and we carry the 4. 9 times 7 is 63, plus the 4 is 67, okay? So, what we can say is that he uses 6,750 milliliters of water. The next, step, uh, next thing to do is to work out how much uh, fluid slash juice there is okay and this is going to be uh the sum so total uh volume is going to be the volume of orange squash plus our volume of water okay and this is going to be uh 6750 milliliters uh, actually first we should start with the volume of the orange juice which is 750 milliliters plus 6750 milliliters of water okay um, in the corner here i'm just going to add these using column addition so 6750 plus 750 okay plus 0 plus 0 is 0 5 plus 5 is 10 0 carry the 1 7 plus 7 is 14 plus the 1 is 15 5 carry the 1 6 plus 1 is 7 okay so we're going to have 7,500 milliliters of uh, total volume. So this equals 7,500 milliliters. Okay, the final thing to do is to work out how many uh, bottles. Okay, now we know that one bottle holds 1,000 milliliters. Okay, because one liter is the same as 1,000 milliliters, like this. So, if we have 7,500 milliliters, to find out how many bottles we need, we first need to work out what we times by 1,000 to get 7,500, okay? So this is times what? And this will be 7,500 over 1,000. Okay, because we're dividing by a multiple of 10, all we need to do is move this decimal place the number of uh, zeros of our denominator. So it's going to be one, two, three for each of the three zeros, and this is going to become 7.5 times. So we times the left hand side by 7.5, so we will end up with 7.5 bottles like this. But the question said, work out the greatest number of one liter bottles that Jimmo can completely fill. Okay, and he can't completely fill the eighth bottle from 0.5, so it is going to be seven complete bottles. So we're going to write uh, round down to seven as not enough for eight, and therefore our final answer is seven bottles. So this uh, question is worth three marks. The first mark comes from finding how much water is needed. Oops. The second mark comes from uh, calculating the total volume, which is 7,500 milliliters. And the third and final mark comes from getting the number of bottles as being seven.